I mean, you can try all of them before you. This is going to be harder than I thought. <laughs> Out of all the changes here on this channel, the different apartments, the different cities, getting married, having a kid, there's been one constant. Based on the title of this, you probably already know it's coffee. I love it when the coffee's done. I mean, there's the beard and the balding and the really dumb humor. Okay, there's a lot of things, but coffee's one of them. Also, we did quit a couple times, but even that was about coffee. Since the last time we quit, I did go back to drinking coffee. Hey, China, what's the best way to make coffee? Pour over. Pour over. I think so, too. Why is it the best? It tastes real good. <laughs> what if we're wrong? What if we're wrong? We're probably not wrong. We're probably not wrong. Ada, what are we watching? What's your favorite show, Ada? So we're gonna try four different types of making coffee using our favorite beans, equal exchange Ethiopian. Oh my God, it's so good. A little sweet, a little perfect. And it is super not a sponsor, we just like it. Another good coffee is awesome coffee by the Vlogbrothers that they made for charity, but we're not using that because we're running low on that on this batch of it. But you could definitely sign up to get that on a regular basis. And not only because it's for charity, but because it's actually delicious. And they didn't tell me to say this, I'm just doing this because I'm their friend and I wanna look like a good person. We're gonna see if we can guess correctly and decide which one we like the best. I'm not gonna make any assumptions, it's probably pour over. <laughs> Can you come over here for a second and pause the music? Why? We gotta talk. Oh, let's dance. They don't want to see me dancing. Pause. Coffee brewing method taste test. We're gonna do pour over. The wonderful pour over method. Heat up the water in the thing, put the thing on the thing, dump the stuff in the thing, and pour this stuff over the stuff. Aeropress. 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 Slap it on the mug. Sprinkle the bean dust into the magic crevasse. You wanna try that while looking up at the lens? No. Okay, don't. Heat up the water. Perform a precision water dump. Stir it up. Even bigger. Stir it up. Stir it up. Stir it up. <laughs> and then, like we say in the industry, we squish the cat. Squish that cat. Squish the cat. Squish that cat. Cat. Squish the cat. Always squish that cat. Squish the cat. French press. French press. French press. Don't drink too much or it'll make you go wee wee. <laughs> Heat up the water. It's better to have a coarse grind. So the filter catches all the bean shards. Dump the coffee in the thinger. Remove the lens cap from the shot. Fill her up. Stir it like a, um, oh, we don't need a metaphor here. Put the cover on and let it sit for like four minutes. <laughs> And then, like your existential anxiety, just push it down. Just push it down. Push it all the way down. Squish that cat. Push it down. Drip. Drip. Drip coffee. More energy. Drip coffee. Put the filter in the thing. Scoop the coffee in the hole. Pour water into the abyss. You ever seen the movie The Abyss? Nope. James Cameron, Ed Harris. I think you'd like it. Should we just go watch that instead? Okay. It's trying to communicate. <laughs> the abyss. It's not a comedy. <laughs> you know what? You're not appreciating it for what it is. Let's go back to the coffee. Put the thing. Push the thing. Twist the thing. Push the thing. Okay. Uh, let's do it. I realize there are different variables to how you make coffee. People are gonna be like, oh, you didn't. Uh, torque the flange. This is the way that we make them. So this is the way that we're familiar with them tasting. She's going to get a pen and paper. In the meantime, I will sing you a song. Stranger. Oh, I thought you were about to walk on camera and cut me off. And now I have to keep singing. Strangers in the night. What? Oh, she cut me off. Too bad. Oh. Mm. My prediction. Oh my gosh, birdie. My prediction is this. Pour over, I'm gonna like the best. French press, it's gonna be delicious, just not my preferred. I think I might like AeroPress slightly better, but I think I'm gonna be able to tell the difference between all of them. Okay. I mean, you can try all of them before you This is gonna be harder than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. French press, drip. Changing my mind. Oh no, I wrote in pen. AeroPress, pour over, drip, French press, Okay, and, and I then. think, I think I like this one best. First place, second place. Yeah. Third place, fourth place. Yes. Okay. In position one over here, we have Bum, ba, da, da, French press. Oh! Okay, so it was AeroPress, it is French press. 
That's totally French, but no, I don't. In position two, bum, ba -da -dum, we have pour over. I you was right. It. Position three, arrow press. In position four, obviously, that is drip, which you thought was French press. That's surprising that I confused French press and drip. Mm hmm. Because I think French press has the most identifiable flavor. I thought so, anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I would have thought so too. I think I will like the pour over best and I think I will like the AeroPress least. Okay. Okay. Well, I don't like that. What do you think of that one? I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't drink your coffee black anyway. No, and I think I might want to add cream to them before I decide. That's better. Okay. Can you get the... It is probably going to be harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Thanks. A something, something, something. No. Now they all taste the same, don't they? I'm just thinking about it. French press, arrow press, pour over. And I like number three best. Four, one, two is by far fourth place. It's a hundredth place. One hundredth. Mm -hmm. Well, very interesting. Number one is French press. Is that what I guessed? That's what you guessed. Number two, you said AeroPress. Uh huh. Drip. Whoa. Number three, you said pour over. Mm hmm. It's pour over. <sighs> that was the only one I cared about getting right. <laughs> Me too. Four, AeroPress. You said okay. drip. So you win. I win. Mm. Wow. <sighs> We've learned that pour over is. Absolutely the best. Pour over is clearly the best. It's very, um, what's the word? Satisfying? No, like. Gratifying? No. Uh, uh, oh, I know what you're looking for. Uh, it's, um, um. It, like when it, when you're like. Isn't self something? Self-assuring? No. It's, um. You're looking it up? No. I hope that someone can jump on Marco Polo. Please help. Immediately. Oh. Oh, I think I almost had it. Shh. <laughs> Validating? That could be it. Validating. 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 Um, it's very validating to know that we both like pour over even in a blind test. But if we have to go through all this to know for sure, does it really matter? Yes, yes it does. Now I'm gonna stop drinking coffee because I drink decaf and this was a bunch of regular and I'm, I am feeling like. I had the rest of my pour over. I'm a little jittery. I'm getting kind of jittery. Drink coffee uh, in moderation guys. Or not at all. Or whatever you want. No. Whatever you want. No. Drink it a lot if you want. But I mean, just know there are consequences. Yeah, like maybe not too much. Yeah, but whatever you want. Live your life. But not too much. YOLO. But not too much. Yo little? There you go. That was a fun experiment that we just immediately had and it, time has not passed and the change in lighting was purely uh, an artistic choice. Oh boy, we just finished and I have the taste of coffee in my mouth. I still do have the taste of coffee in my mouth. It hasn't been that long. I've had some water. And I also had an ice cream cone. <laughs> Ah, that might be a factor. Speaking of factor, oh. I'd like to thank the sponsor of this video. They're, it's Factor. Do you like Factor? I love Factor. Do you love their delicious, nutritious, fresh, never frozen, chef prepared, nummy, nummy vittles? You've eaten them. I have. They, they were nummy, nummy. <laughs> delivered right to my doorstep? I would prefer it if they delivered them right to my doorstep. Let's share a doorstep. <gasps> oh my God, are you asking? Do you live with me? Yes. Okay. Now and in the past. Okay. Factor saves us time that we're going to need to prepare our ridiculously complicated coffee that we drink. We're going to drink all four of them now. Every morning? Yes. Oh my God. You have a rainbow on your face. Oh my God. Thank you. You always do. Registered dietitians work hand in hand with the chefs. I mean, I hope they don't actually hold their hands. It'd be hard to cook while you're holding hands. We have to flip it. Flip it. Look. Stir. The menu is updated weekly and it includes 27 plus meals with 33 plus add-ons. You love add-ons. I love to add things to other things. When we go to a restaurant, you're like, mm, can I have some extra add-ons, please? Uh-huh. And then they bring you like 
a radish. Uh-huh. And like a... Just one whole raw <laughs> radish. Yeah. That's not the kind of add-on. No, I'm talking about lots of different kinds of add-ons that I'm probably showing on screen right now. You choose your favorite meals or you let Factor craft your meal orders based on your taste preferences and history. And did I mention that it's delicious? Can I get some backup? It's delicious. Let's harmonize it when I say it. Ready? It's, it's delicious. delicious. But what about HelloFresh? You've talked about them before too. Ah, but, mm, calm down. Bop. HelloFresh owns Factor. What? It's a wider array of meals to choose from. I love switching between brands. You know me. I'm wearing a whatever brand this is today, and yesterday I was wearing a whatever brand that was. Uh-huh. And you can enjoy switching brands at a discount with me if you go to go.factor75.com slash wheezy60 because I'm, I've just turned 60 years old. No, because you get 60% off your first box. You were worried that you married a 60 year old. I was really, really concerned Yeah. about the decade of lies. <laughs> <laughs> That's go.factor75.com slash wheezy60 and use code wheezy60 to get 60% off your first box. Okay. Okay, I'll do it. You don't have to. I'll do it. No, no, I already signed us up. We're I'll fine. do it. No, 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 we got I'm gonna it. Do, I gotta no. Hang on, I just gotta do no, something. Uh uh. No, no, don't. Maybe, oh. maybe you order for my parents or your parents. You don't have to do it. Stop it. Sorry, I can't listen to what you're saying. I'm in the middle of something. We're gonna have. I'll listen to you right after this. We're gonna have too much ridiculously oh, delicious God. food. We can give it to our neighbors. Uh, um, Guys, that's enough. That's it. That's, we're done. We're done. That's it. We need a conclusion of some kind. This was a fun experiment, China. I'm glad to have done that with you. This was a fun experiment, Craig. I'm also glad to have done that with you. I'm glad we can finally talk candidly right now. I love talking with my husband. Me too. And That's you. You know what I like to do while I'm talking to you? I like to turn to the right and wink. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. I already did it. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Let's do it again. Okay. Well, you don't do it, though. Why Let's just do it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> hmm. <laughs>